Alright guys, I cut out a lot of bullshit. I mean a lot of bullshit, where I was for the most part just running around like a dumbass, etc. Accomplishing absolutely nothing. Well, I'm in West Elizabeth now, I just got up here. I could have supposed, I guess I could have shown myself riding up here, but it's a long fucking ride, nobody probably gives a shit. And uh, now I'm going for the American Standard Bread. The third and best horse in the game, blah blah blah. I know where it is, it's actually by John's house. That's where it hangs out, as a matter of fact. It's kind of fucked up, but it does. It always hangs out by John's house. Usually at night is the best time to find it, too. I'm kind of looking over these horses now. And nope, not the right color. American Standard Bread is straight black, so it's pretty easy to find when you're looking for it. But anyway, up to the left you see John's house. That's his actual ranch house. Yep. Let's go. This is this is John's land we're on right now. So yeah, the American Standard Bread will always appear on John's land. I found it several times here. Not a problem ever. It's just it, John's land is also quite massive. So you know it could be in the southern part. I found it in the south. I found it up in the north by the railroad tracks. Yeah. I don't remember where I actually find it here. Yeah, this is post commentary. You know, because I cut out a bunch of shit and that was meaningless. So. Me accomplishing nothing. That was awesome, by the way, jumping over that fence. So it kind of messes up my live comms, you know. Not that it matters anyway. I really don't think anybody gives a shit, as long as I'm commentating the video, right? Kind of looking at the map now. Usually I find it down here, so that's where I'm going to head, down to this waypoint. Easy. Watch over the rocks, Bob. Way to get over that fence. What the hell is that? Looks like a box of some sort. I'm just kind of looking out. This is a great spot to sit and look for them, by the way, because you can really see a out a ways. They won't spawn, though, if you just sit there and do nothing. Look at that. I think I got him. No, apparently not. I didn't seem interested in that horse. No, not now, buddy. Ah, uh, no, I don't exactly have a green thumb, but thanks. I am kind of busy looking for my horse. Uh, what do we got here, John? Oh, look at that. There he is. This guy is quick. And he, he's a badass, too. This is like, okay, yeah. Anybody who used to watch Zorro, yeah, this is fucking Tornado right here. Right? Exactly. Now, he's gonna throw me. He'll throw you one time, every time. I have never broken this horse and not had it throw me at least once. It has never happened. He, he's tough. There he goes, he's throwing me. Good news is, he didn't bother running too far away, so I could re him without having to grab Bob and chase him down. Oh, now he's dragging me. This is funny. Look at this shit. Okay, now he's running away. Bob, we're gonna have to go get him. You want to keep him in sight, definitely. Because it, it, it's really frustrating when you have the horse, and then it throws you, and then it runs off, and you can't find it again. Okay. No, do not drag me. Get back. <laughs> Look at that. He's kicking my ass. <laughs> Come on, Bob. We gotta go get him. Yeah, this is a tough one. This is the toughest horse to break in the game because it's the fucking best horse in the game. Ah, we got him. And we're out. Right. Let's see if we can get this guy. God damn it, yeah, exactly, John. Yeah, as Ant Antonio Banderas said in The Mask of Zorro, I'm going to give you the honor of being my horse. Exactly. Yep. Bob. <laughs> I could call him Tornado. Nah, why rip off Zorro? We'll just stick with Bob. 
This guy hauls ass. Uh, yeah. No, this horse's weakness is it has, like, the lowest health of the three rare ones, though. I mean, it'll go down in, like, two or three gunshots, so you definitely don't want this horse getting shot. But it's really fucking fast, as we're about to see. I'm looking at the map now. I don't know why I'm looking at the map. I know I didn't finish some shit down in New Austin and in Mexico yet. No, I have Periso, if anybody really wants me to be specific. But, uh, yeah, I, the, I re, the only reason I came up here to West Elizabeth, I'm not ready to continue with the story, was to get that horse. <laughs> I think I ran around and fucked off, too, looking for that last place I don't have. Out of, uh, in New Austin, I only have 44 of the 45 uh, locations found. I do find the 45th one. I don't know if I have done that yet, and I cut that out or not. But it actually really pissed me off when I did find it because it's not really in New Austin. It's actually right across the tracks into Nuevo Pariso. Yeah. So it's like, what the fuck? Why does this count as a New Austin area? But it does. Yeah, it took me hours to find that. Very frustrating. I don't even know where I'm going now. I, I played this so fucking long ago. I was looking over my recordings and I'm like, okay, I did nothing for like... 37 minutes. Yeah, well, I mean, like, I was, you know, using, constantly saving the game to advance time so bounties would appear and shit like that. You know, it's just stuff that you guys do not need to see, or probably do not care to see. Who the hell wants to see me standing around waiting for shit, you know? Let's go. Uh, I guess I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm heading back to New Austin, obviously. Back there pretty quickly. Yeah, I'm not even flooring it and I'm moving. I'm just, this is just standard gallop speed for this horse. As you can see, its stamina is full. Now I'm flooring it. Yeah. One stamina gauge and I'm already in Hennigan's stead. Yeah, exactly. Alright, Bob, we'll let you rest for a little bit. I mean, <laughs> why not? You'll get me there pretty quickly. I actually timed it. To get from Blackwater to Chuparosa, or not Chuparosa, Escalera, it takes about five minutes with this horse. You think five minutes, you know, that's a long time, but no, it isn't, considering how massive this game is. No, I'm not doing Night Watch. Thank you very much. I am doing something. I just can't remember what I'm doing. I know I had something. It was like, oh, oh, hey, you didn't want to jump that fence. Why didn't you jump the fence? I don't think this one... Yeah, he jumps that one. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Bob, you're making me look stupid here. You don't jump the first fence, but you jump the second fence? He, he's just not used to his new master yet. That must be what it is. I also need to very quickly, as in very rapidly, get to a store, that store, so I can buy the deed to this horse. First thing I'm going to want to do, naturally, I think I'm heading for Armadillo. But then, I want to get to Armadillo, I want to, you know, hitch him, so he becomes mine. But then I want to, as soon as I possibly can, buy the deed for him. If he gets killed, I'm going to be really pissed. <laughs> before I have ownership of him, you know. Although I'll just have to go to a store and buy it. Once you break the horse, you can buy the deed to it. So, that's kind of nice. I, I wouldn't have to go out and look for another one and break it again. Yeah, I'm definitely putting some background music here. This ride isn't as long as it could have been. <laughs> Still a pretty fucking long ride, though. And we're in Armadillo. Here we go. Yes, I'm gonna hit him now. As soon as I get the fucking command, there it is.
Very good, Bob. You just kind of hang out and shit. I'm sober as a judge. I'm sure you're not. Yeah, snow my trusty steed. What the hell am I doing here? Oh, right, I'm gonna go up to Twin Rocks. I don't... I, I haven't cleared Twin Rocks yet. I, too quick? I think that's like the only U.S. hideout I haven't cleared yet. Or did I do Fort Mercer? I don't know. I must be thinking about that right here. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm... Yeah. Maybe I was, you know, pouring myself another Yukon to do. I don't know. Yeah, we're gonna get there pretty fast, but aren't we, Bob? Now, I've never done this hideout before, so this is why I'm not going straight towards it, because I don't exactly know where it is. So I'm gonna have to ride around for a moment to find it. I know it's like a, it's like a house or something. I don't know if I knew that when I first came up here. Yeah, I'm looking at the map again. I'm right there, yeah, I need to go down there, I think. It's actually, if you see my X, it's up to the le upper left of that, those two buildings there, but I don't believe I figured that out right away. Oh yeah, I'll be playing music here or something until I get there. And what the cell, put something here. The full moon shot's pretty cool. See, now why would I have to go all the way around here? I'm, I'm just following the fucking red line, but why is the red line taking me all the way down here and all the way over? Fuck that, I'm cutting across. Uh, let's see a campfire. That's a good sign. But this, yeah, there's nobody shooting at me, so I know I haven't found it yet. I mean, it's pretty obvious. Nobody's shooting at you, you haven't found it yet. Now, okay, now I'm fucking thinking. Yeah, exactly, the houses up there are stupid. You know, the only place where there's buildings where there could be, you know, bandits hiding. Yeah. Remove cranium from anus. Meat rancher at near the rock. Yeah, here we go. This looks like fun. <laughs> I could Excuse really me. use a hand, friend. I'm way over my head here. Them animals. Walton's boys have taken my daughter. Looks like we got trouble heading our way. We're gonna need a new set of nut crackers. Oh, yeah, I just opened oh fire. What the hell? Oh, well, there's one. There's two. This guy's on that rock. You really I think he finally went down. Yeah, sometimes I like to just sit behind cover and see where they're shooting from. Get behind the rock, John. There you go. 